Hi and welcome back to Red Rev 1917. We're on the Boston Sprinter again uh, and we're doing a service from Boston South Station to Redville or Reedville maybe, not sure how you pronounce it. So without further ado, let's get some passengers on board and get this service ready to run. So reverses in, reverses forwards. MUA trial valve to lead, cut off valve is in engine run generator field control pumps both on headlights to bright uh, we don't need rear lights I'm sure we don't need rear lights on um, horn is pressed and we're loading some passengers up as we speak it's only a short blast this one uh, we've just got Boston Back Bay, Ruggles and Red Reedville they're the only three stops uh, it's just I just fancied a quick blast and this was an ideal route to do to be honest with you so passengers are on board doors are locked brake is released and away we go says are we going we will be going shortly and now we're going so we're in the F40 looking piece of equipment really enjoy playing this route to be honest with you it's it's got the right mix of short and long scenarios and timetables um, it is really really well done yes there are issues but let's ignore the issues and let's just concentrate on the positives because ultimately it's, it's bloody playable so we're just doing nine and a half miles an hour as we're leaving the station uh, we've got five minutes to get to Boston Back Bay so let's just keep moving uh, it's only a mile away. Let's put some safety systems on. Slap my wrist. We left the station without the safety systems on. That was silly, wasn't it? We fixed it now anyway. They are now on. Just going to keep idling along. Do the interlocking past the yard got a really really badly sighted signal I just cannot see it until you're on top of it I'm assuming because my in cab display is not going mad at me, I've no way to proceed. We are. As soon as we get past the interlocking, we can get up to 15 miles an hour. I'm going to have to apply a bit of brake. I was creeping over the speed limit. It's not good. Then I had a long. Notice that on the hood I've turned off the next signal indication and also the next speed limit change. So I'm doing this purely from the in cab safety system, the speed limits, and obviously just reading the signals as we get to them. If I could, I would turn off the bottom right hand hood. I don't like the hood. But I do want the clock. And specifically, I want the clock. And I want to know when I can leave the station. 
um, I do find it just break the immersion having all these hoods and displays it's okay when you're learning the route but once you've learned the route it is a distraction so you find yourself looking at the hood rather than the track that's not how you drive a train in your life So there's Lakeshore Limited. What was pulling that train? Because there's no electric on that line. So how was that train moving? That's a very good point. There's no Amtrak diesels in this case. DLC included. So what on earth is pulling that train? I will go back and have a look through the video and see what was pulling that train. So there was an ACS 64. There's some serious issues. There's an ACS 64 overhead cables, overhead wires, and those lines that was running on having an overhead gantry. So how was that train moving? It must have been magic. Passengers are loaded. Doors are locked. I'm not going to release the brakes completely on the account that we are on an incline and I do want some brakes Right, next stop, Ruggles. Well, you have miles to go to Ruggles. Oh, I've got my hat lights on, I've got my lights on, sure, I've got my lights on. I did have my lights on. Just check in. Cab lights are on as well. Because this tunnel is a dark tunnel. It's a dark, dark tunnel. That's where we leave Boston Back Bay. Give it a little bit of whirly.
think I broke a little bit earlier. Oh, well, I'm here now. Gonna be a few seconds late, no doubt. Yeah, I broke far too early. But what's a few seconds between friends? Quite a lot, he says. There we go. Get some passengers on board. About 30 seconds later or so. Get those doors locked. And on we go. To go via. Not stop it, we're just going via. high speed running while we can. There's no doubt the signals will slow us down eventually. So we'll get as much high speed running as we can. Sundown. What is the ACS? Light work with this line at the moment. More to the ACS again. So I was reading somewhere these trains are actually limited to 80 miles an hour. That's a maximum permitted speed. But I'm not sure on that one. Don't know how lucky that is. If you know the route, let me know. I'm going to assume we can do 90, but that's what the speed limit's telling me I can do. This is 19 mile an hour speed limit. And 
no change for me on that one. Down to 45. I just got to end up going lower than 45. I find that you can take off the thread with suppression mode as soon as you're in the yellow. And you don't get penalised if anywhere to break. Don't know if that's post typical or not, but it's what I've been doing. Down to thirty. I think I've been flummoxed by the in cab signaling issues here. I don't think I should be doing 30 yet, but that's what the game's telling me to do, that's what the signals are telling me to do, that's what I'm doing. If I'm late, I'm late. It's actually yellow, so I'm already doing 30. Keep your air in. That looks like a green to me, so I should be able to increase speed soon. You'd hope. Half a mile. It wasn't a green signal at all, it was a marker.
I could be 30. I think it's going to be too late for me. I suspect the problem with this is it wasn't giving me a path past that go via point until I got to it. So as far as it was concerned, it was going to be a red signal until I got to it, and then obviously the signal changed. I think if that had been green, I'd have been going faster and I'd probably been in time. I think that may well be the issue on this section. Because as it is, we're going to be very late. But you can only go as fast as the signals tell you you can go. So I'm going at the signal speed. So I'm expecting a switch out. Here we are, here's the switch out. And here is Red Drill. V drill even. And here we are. <laughs> Doors locked, and we've done all right. No overspeed. We've got gold. 
I'm happy with that. Uh, that was a really quick blast down the Boston Sprinter to Reedville from Boston Back Bay. I've been Red Rev 1917. Uh, if you enjoyed watching this video, you want to see more, feel free to give me a subscription. Uh, if you want to know when I upload videos or go live, press the bell button to get notified. It's that simple. You can also follow me on Instagram, Red Rev 1917. I post a few screenshots of stuff. Uh, but thanks for watching, take care, bye bye.